Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of the Sean Sense outside the American Legion Hall here in Reseda, California. After another great PWG show, don't sweat the neck. I'm with one of your heroes best, Tommy fucking N, man. How you doing? <laughs> I'm good, man. I'm good. How are you? Good, man. You went to a fucking war of hero, man. It's fucking amazing. Thank you very much. Tommy Glover with hero, man. One of your mentors and stuff. He is. Definitely is, yeah. Chris and me have known each other for, uh, well, I've been wrestling almost 14 years. And, uh, he was a, a big influence in my early days of my wrestling career. And, uh, he came over to Germany and Europe a lot where you know, I got the chance to train with him a lot. And over the years, we kept in touch and you know, could usually give me feedback. And uh, well, you know, 14 years later, here we are. Now, been the strike and the back and forth, and the crowd got so hot for it. Mm. Is that, how does the compare, crowd compare to everything over else? And the WXW is a hot crowd. You know what? Like, um, we have such good crowds. In, in, in Europe, but this was really unique. And I'm not, not saying that to say this to put anything on. It's because one like, America's well, best. <laughs> like this doesn't have to, it, it, this doesn't have to have more uh, uh, credits than, it's, than it already gets. Like this is legit. Like, yeah. um, you know, like everyone's like goes told me about like how much, uh, how much fun uh, Bros and Grill is and like how the crowds are and stuff like that. So, um, you know, finally witnessing it and like experiencing it live, it's nothing compares. It was, it was awesome, but you know, like I said, Europe, we have great crowds. Japan has awesome crowds. Yeah, definitely. America has great crowds. And, like, everything has, like, it's, it's like, everything's different. Everything has its own, um, own perks, basically. Definitely. You got this is awesome chance. You got the please come back chance. Yeah, I'm was really that a happy. goal for you to get the please come back chance? My goal was to just uh, <laughs> be, be uh, staying alive during the match. Yeah, yeah, hero. So this. Whatever, uh, whatever was uh, was was left was uh, was uh, was icing in the cake. A lot of elbows to the head. A lot of two. Yeah. Power uh, drivers. Yep. The gout. The gotch. Not the gotch. gotch. Not gout. Yep. Gotch. <laughs> Gout is way worse. <laughs> gout is way worse. We don't want gout. We don't, we don't <laughs> the gout pile driver. The gout pile driver. You've been here first. Uh, yeah, no, uh, it, it was, uh, uh, I have I have a great chemistry with my own mentor, so that's, you know, that's a, that's a big plus. And I don't think I could have had a better debut here in Reseda than against, you know, Chris Hero. Basically a re-debut in PWG. Sorry? Re-debut, because you did the yeah, well, European. That's that's why I said debut. Yeah, I know. They were um, received and not debut. Yeah, I was I was talking <laughs> I, I was talking about that this afternoon <laughs> with uh, with one of the guys and I like I, I, I always have this thing where I kinda undermine myself yeah. and I think, oh no one remembers like when I like ten years ago did did, did some show. I haven't seen the match, before. but I just heard about it like yeah. I like know my facts before I interview people. Like no. Yeah, exactly. Like and so technically <laughs> technically this wasn't my debut. However, there's been ten years in between, it was a different country, so let's just call Call this my official debut for Pro Wrestling right. Gorilla. First time, like the, the year difference or the country difference. Yeah. First exactly. time, I think someone's done that. Exactly. Exactly. So. Let's talk about the great, great weekend last week at Dayton Live, Thank you. Santa Clara Fairgrounds. You had three great opponents. How was that atmosphere? A lot of British fans were there, so it kind of felt like home a little bit. Yeah, it was. It was surprising <laughs> to see that like uh, so many fans from uh, the United Kingdom and from uh, Germany, even, and uh, you know, a, a lot of other places in uh, in, in, in Europe. Uh, came over for uh, for Evolve and obviously you know Romania weekend so like they came over for everything. Um, it was really welcoming to uh, have that reception, you know, coming in and you know obviously the fans getting to know me, getting that first glimpse of like uh, who I am and what I do. So um, the whole the whole uh, um, experience so far with doing Evolve and, and doing Pro has been has been nothing but great, really. Can you give me your thoughts on each opponent you had that weekend for uh, Dayton Live? Uh, I think on the, on the the first day it was me and Biff. Biff is a is a young upcomer. Biff is a, Biff is a great talent. Very hard hitting. Very, Biff very is strong. Very strong. Very strong. And yeah. he, uh, you know, he he, he, he brought it. He, uh, uh, I I didn't go into this match thinking like, oh, you know, I'm just gonna get this young 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 kid and just you know beat the shit out of him. Yeah. Not at all. Like I'm. I'm smarter than that. I don't underestimate any of my opponents. The same goes for Timothy. I like the man's a beast. When you just look at him, he's just oh, like he looks like a fighter. He's a chance. man's man wrestler. Oh, yeah. yeah, he's just like a throwback. He is. A, he's a phenomenal competitor. I, I I foresee big things happening for Timothy Thatcher. I definitely and see this building him wrestling here sooner or later. I, I hopefully hope with, sooner. I hope with the style that I've brought tonight, like the door for Timothy, you know, will become more. You know, available because obviously, you know, Timothy's more of a mat yeah. and a striker, so am I. Um, him, obviously, more than me on the mat, and I'm more striking. Yeah. Um, that was a good mix. You kind of changed that. We talked about before this interview. Yeah. You changed your style for that match, more mat wrestling. And well, you're, you're more accustomed to the striking. For uh, for like for those of you who do not know, <laughs> uh, 
I've done martial arts all my life. Oh, like cool. I've I've been a I've been a competitive kickboxer at the uh, since the age of nine because you can get licensed really uh, young in Holland. Okay. Uh, I've did Penchak Shilat, I've done Muay Thai, I've done all sorts of martial arts, but you know kickboxing being the being the main one really. So um, you know I incorporate anything that uh, to my style, hence making it you know look like the way it does and it definitely looks very sharp and crisp thank you very much i appreciate that yeah. i don't know where we're going <laughs> sorry i just like i feel like that jeopardy music like <laughs> <laughs> well, wow, we still have to cover the cover the four-way oh the um, four-way man you know um getting their tj perkins man. well the mat you know the, the veteran the veteran you know like i was happy to uh, the, you know to, to work with uh to compete against uh tj perkins I've, I've always wanted to do that um you know, Drew also I drew my, some. I remember my thought now. I, I, I'm just sorry. I remember my thought. It's just my brain's kind of slow. But definitely what Evolve's doing is bringing back the technical wrestling, kind of bring it more to the forefront. Yes. With Gulak and Thatcher. That's what we did last last year. Not everybody's cup of tea, but that's what they're trying to bring back now. Instead of all the spot fest and the high flying, that's good, but we need a place for it to bring back the map base. I think, uh, you know, if you look at wrestling, wrestling is a circus and you need a little bit of everything. Yeah. You know, so you need you, you need the big dudes, you need the flyers, you need the map based wrestlers, you need yeah. the guys who, you know, go out there and just, you know, tell it, tell great stories and like, um, you need everything. And yeah. I think Evolve has a really good package in delivering everything to whatever a wrestling fan, you know, wants. Wrestling with Faye, I think. The course, yes, the different yes, course. Uh, exactly. So there's like, there's something for everything. And Evolve does a great job in doing so. And, you know, I'm, I'm very happy to, uh, to, you know, to be a part of all this and uh, contribute to uh, my part, basically. So now we got that part. Let's go back to the four way. We rewind it <laughs> um, now. We got um, rewinded. Yeah, like uh, obviously being in there, but Drew was completely new to me. Drew also no joke. Oh, uh, Drew very is so hard hitting, very hard hitting, very uh, very smart, very sharp as well. He's been on my show over five times now. Been Sorry, on, he's been on my show a lot. Yeah, the one of the most been on the show a lot. Most of he's uh, he's a very uh, very well spoken uh, human being, very intelligent as well. So you know that makes him a very dangerous competitor as well. Yeah, um, the four way itself, I was. Um, I was blown away by the talent. Um, every guy was just on point. Everyone, you know, uh, 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 everyone competed at, at, at you know at the at the highest level. And you know, I I, I think it's safe to say that the fair guy won. It was uh, it was a very intense competition. If your American tour comes up, I mean, it continues after this. Yeah. Well, what's up next? I know you got AEW uh, coming up. I've got I've super got, kicked. Yeah, I've got uh, Rockstar. Rockstar uh, for and, wrestling. Uh, yes, in the Chris Ohio. Brothers. Yes, yes, yes. Getting to hang with my uh, with my with my brother Dave Chris. Um, you're not new to the WrestleCon experience, the Dayton Mania Weekend. You're from Marion Death Squad. You guys wrestled a couple years ago yeah, did, at yeah. CZW yes, wrestling. Was it Order for K? Sorry, Order for K, right? Yes, uh, that, that was great, man. Yes, uh, and, Dave, thank you very much, Dave and Jake. Yeah. Um, uh, then I got uh, AAW against uh, you know Tommaso. Oh, Tommaso. Then we. Uh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's gonna good. Be a that's fight. good. I can't. I'm it's already, going to be I'm, a fight. I'm, I'm dollars fan before. Definitely. <laughs> I'm a guy Alexander Joe, but and Champa. That's yeah, yeah, that's that's money be, there uh, too. Have fun. And that show's uh, <laughs> uh, CCW, best of the best, which will always obviously be uh, be a huge deal. Best of the best is always loaded with the best talent. You know, the best new talent. Just added up. CJP from uh, NXT. CJ Parker. There you go. And uh, trying to then, re reinvent yeah. himself. Yeah. After everything. De definitely. And then it's uh, me. Uh, me. And it's uh, Canada <laughs> Super Kick, which I'm extremely excited for. And then I fly back to Scotland for uh, SWA and ICW, and I go back to home to Amsterdam. And I don't want to <laughs> get on a plane for the next, well, probably two days. I'll be probably go like, eh, I want to go back in the ring. So um, that's my schedule right now. Definitely, you can follow all his updates uh, and where you, you can find him. What's your Twitter? Tommy End. Quite quick. So. Twitter.com slash Tommy End, quite easy. You can follow Facebook, Tommy End. Same. Instagram slash Tommy End. And we're going to find uh, shirts. So you know, the anti hero yes. we're selling now. Um, we're, we're restocking the website right now. It's www.cultofdeathsquad.com. Huh? A scary name. Very, <laughs> we're very scary dudes. It's <laughs> <laughs> a Death Squad. That's a pretty. Yeah, thanks, thanks, for, thanks for no taking problem, time man. out. Talk to me. Make sure to like, subscribe, and peace, man. <laughs> Buy a freaking t 